I Jimmy Edwards here and one of the things that I'm very passionate about is people really not just understanding but really knowing how the part of mind that writes their name in capital letters has a massive impact on uh, their performance in terms of getting themselves out of the way. Said differently, and to simplify this, I call this bullseye communication. So um, think of, we got a bullseye here, and the bullseye is the unconscious mind. Now, many of you have been to a hotel or a restaurant where you may not have had great service, and you wanted to, you wanted to literally uh, speak to somebody at the front desk and make a complaint. Um, you've probably had that experience. If you've been in a retail store, you've got your receipt, and you want to exchange your goods. And you go back and you think it's going to be pretty quick and you're going to get your money back. Okay? But unfortunately for you, the girl or the guy at front desk, it's been their day to really annoy somebody. And so you're that person, it becomes a debate, it becomes more challenging. And there's only one person in the building who can make that decision. And that's the person upstairs, that's the manager, the decision maker. Well, what I want you to think about right now is that your unconscious mind is the decision maker. It's the manager. The conscious mind just justifies what the unconscious makes that decision beforehand. And so your mind is designed to do two things. It's designed to protect you and it's designed to keep you the same, to maintain you. And so... Whether it's communication, whether it's sports, whether it's business, whether it's life, it's how, how quickly, how effectively, and how more frequently we can communicate to this part of the mind. This is important, yes, but we want to be communicating here. In the area of influence, and an influence is the number one skill in life, I want you to think of it like this. We need to think about like this. I call it the influence sandwich. Three layers of the, the sandwich. The first layer of the sandwich is trust. Okay? So do you, whether it's trust yourself, do you trust your technique? Um, are, you, are you building trust with your client or your customer? Said differently, that could be connection, that could be rapport. So that's the first layer of the sandwich. The middle layer of the sandwich is are you asking effective questions, good questions, quality questions. And then the, the bottom layer of the sandwich is experience. Do you leave your customer in a really good state? Do you give them a great experience? Do they become married to your brand? Okay, that's the influence sandwich.